What's up everybody, this is Rob Shack. So today we're gonna to be doing the next level in my, or not next level, but the next race car driver. We're gonna be trying to take on Emily with the uh, Phoenix PT ICX car that sucks really bad, but we'll see if I can beat the uh, Emily's car with this thing. Um, it should be a doozy, but help me get to a thousand subs. Y'all are awesome. Thank you so much for the support. It's We've been growing a lot recently, so thank you, thank you, thank you a lot for that. Um, yeah, I'm going to try to take on Emily. I don't remember what her last car's name is. I think it's like 370DS or something like that. It's got like a very BMW-y name, but obviously it's not an actual BMW because licensing, but it's basically a BMW. Um, and I'm going to be driving this muscle car that has absolutely no control and also doesn't know how to have gear settings and you can't change the gear settings in this game but wow you know let's get to how about we be in we should not be in fourth gear by 70 miles an hour it should be like second gear so that's it's pretty hilarious that they did that for the setting oh and this car doesn't have nos too so we're really uh gonna make it difficult for ourselves to win this race but i think we can do it i mean i'm gonna try my best but basically i can't get below fourth gear. I have to always stay in fourth gear because the second the car goes in the third gear, it starts sliding around from the behind, back of the car starts sliding out and it's really, really hard to control it. And even when you tap the handbrake, it's really hard to control it because look at that. Like I'm just sliding around with, even though I was in fourth gear, I'm just sliding back and forth like an idiot. So we'll see if I can actually do this. <laughs> it's going to be a challenge for sure. Um, but I think we can maybe make it happen. I mean, I want to be able to say that I successfully used every car in this game to accomplish something and I'm like I think I saved the hardest for last here or for the middle of the game here because I'm going to be using a car that is very under prepared to take on a BMW type car so we'll be we'll see I'm going to try to keep catch up to her but I mean this car is completely completely out of control it's kind of terrible um, but once I catch up to her and get the thing where I challenge her to a race, I'm gonna try to uh, I'm gonna try to not lose the race. Um, it's the dream is to try to not do that. Uh, there she is, by the way. So yeah, it looks it doesn't actually that one doesn't look as much like a BMW as her first two cars, but it's still got a little bit of a hint of some. Uh, what the heck? What is he doing? What is she doing? Why do these drivers like to fake me out? That's hilarious. But I'm she's she's not she doesn't seem like she's that aggressive in driving here. So we'll see if I can actually catch up to her again and do this thing. But yeah, this car is uh this car's pretty awful. So I mean, look at how much it slides. I like literally cannot control this car to save my life. So I'm just gonna try to get it to fourth gear because it's the secret to this car is get it to fourth gear. And if you can't get it to fourth gear, then you're gonna slide around. And even in fourth gear, you're probably gonna still slide around because this car is really, really freaking bad. Um, also, it has very low durability, so like, you're gonna also you're gonna hit a bunch of crap, and then also not be able to control the car. So you know, it's just the it really is the perfect storm of kind of a garbage car here. So I'm gonna try to beat her with this. I'll complain about it. I'm complaining about it a lot, and I apologize for that. But I'm just like, I mean, I wish y'all could see my me trying to actually keep this car on the road and keep it straight it's like very challenging but um she is really does not know where she wants to go which is hilarious um she's just gonna turn around i guess and we're gonna drive over these stupid hills which i hate when the drivers do this because i'm like i it's like she literally knows that i'm driving the worst car in the game i think this is the worst car in the game at least the taxi can stay straight <laughs> like I bet I would lose the taxi with this thing but um she's I don't know what she's doing though she's kind of going easy on me a lot she's just driving around in circles here I think she's gonna try to head this way so I'm gonna try to literally guess where she's going because she's all over the place maybe she's out of control too but at least her car will have NOS so my hope is that I'll beat her and then once I get to the starting lineup I'll stop talking because I'll have to focus on actually keeping this car under control I mean, this car is hilariously bad. Um, once you get into fourth gear, you're good. But it's just that's not a good that's not a good criteria for what makes a car sustainable. Is can you get it into fourth gear as quickly as possible? Because you should just not do that. You just shouldn't drive the car. But 
but this is my this is the the curse I wanted, which was I want to be able to um, say that I used every car in this game to get one of the races done. Uh, she went into the red zone just for a second there, but now she's back to green. I happened to catch up to her enough to make it work, but she is kind of juking me a little bit here, but I can't go faster than this, and it seems like she knows that and is being kind of nice to me, so I appreciate her being like this, and we got it. So, yeah, this is crazy, so we'll see. I'm going to be focused on this one, so thank you all for watching. Subscribe, enjoy the video, and hopefully it doesn't take me forever. Peace!
been waiting for all these years a real trip.
You really think you've got an 